Hey guys and welcome to a brand new video lesson. I hope you've all been keeping well and today I've got a very very cool 30 second note lick that just pumps like mad. So before we break this one down please download the PDF sheet music from the YouTube description below, print it out and be sure to follow along with me as we uh, as we get this one going. So this lick is a 30 second note lick and as you guys may know a full bar of 30 second notes in 4-4 time means you play 32 notes, no rocket science there. But this lick is based upon 16 hits, which means it will fit neatly into half a bar of 4-4 as 30 second notes, okay? So this one's a little bit wordy to break down, but it's about to come up on screen and I'll break it down with you. So you want to be playing right, left, left, right, right, left, which is a classic six stroke roll. And then you're going to be playing right, left, left, foot, and then right, left, right, left, left, foot. So it's quite a big combo and I would recommend breaking it down slowly even in chunks like the six stroke and then the four hits right left left foot and then the uh, the six hits at the end which is right left right left left foot okay but let's um let's hear it slow on the kit just so you guys can get used to the sound of it here we go So as you'll notice, it's between the snare, tom three, and the bass drum. And to me, it just gives it like a really nice attack. It gives it like this pumping attack sound. So as we speed it up, you're gonna hear that more and more, and it's gonna become quite a furious little lick. So let's check it out fast. Okay, good. So as I said, this is a fill-in that fits into half a bar of 4-4 four, four time, half a bar of 30 second notes, so a 16 note combo. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to play it along with the groove, nice and contextualized so you can see, uh, so you can hear how it needs to be pulled off. So let's check it out with the groove. There we go guys, that's my lick for today. I hope you guys enjoyed yourself. Do remember to take it really slow at first, try and get used to the vocabulary and the muscle memory of what this fill-in is made up of. And then just have fun, like it's really easy to orchestrate this one around the kit. It can even be the foundation of a drum solo if you really get creative with it. But I absolutely love it, it's packed full of nice rudiments, lots of nice opportunities to play accents and nice colors around the kit. So let's, uh, let's see what you guys come up with. Please leave a comment in, uh, in the description below if you guys enjoyed this and please remember to hit like and subscribe so that I can help grow my YouTube channel. Alright guys, I'm going to end it with a little bit more grooving and you're going to also see my social media links appear. So have a great day and I'll see you all real soon.